Okay, so today is April 10th. Um, I'm going out fishing again. I'm sorry I haven't been filming too much. I actually fished yesterday on the 9th, the Tuesday, and we uh, on a charter, and we loaded up on some mahi. So uh, I didn't fish then, like I didn't uh, get any video, but I'll show you a picture and a video right now. Yeah, so as you saw, we caught, I caught um, uh, some nice bulls, cows, and um, and after that, I went out and fished, and uh, I trolled. Uh, as you saw in the Blue Runner video, I trolled for them, trolled spoons, but the tide's low right now, and um, it's not gonna be good trolling. So right here, I've got some squid and um, a bottom rig, and I might troll around a little bit, but uh, trolling's better at a higher tide, and it's like low tide right now. So um, it's pretty windy, it's pretty rough, but um, there's a turtle right there. But um, I'm gonna hope to uh, get on some fish I have about half hour, hour, something like that, 45 minutes. So um, yesterday I fished on here after we got back from chartering and um, I caught a little lizard fish. Here's a picture of that. And uh, yeah, so I'm just making my way out to cut now and uh, see if I can get into something. Kind of confident. I need to find a piece of structure to fish. Well, I thought I got a cool montage of me running out the cut because it was a little bouncy and stuff, but my camera wasn't recording. But this piece of structure right here, I never knew it went like all this far. It looks like an old barge almost, like a sunken ship. But um, this is prime structure for bottom fishing. Thus, I'm in 10 feet of water, so it's not that deep. I'm still gonna try to cast over here with some squid and uh, see what I can get. I gotta be careful not to run up on it because I'll get stuck, but that's actually a cool piece of structure. I don't know if you can see that, but it looks like an old barge or something. A lot of sunken boats around here, but I just, I just ran out the chair from the back here, so I'm gonna get some squid on and see what I can do. Right here is um, Shimano Solstice 4000, 15 pound braid, or 30 backing, but 15 top shot. Medium heavy Shimano uh, symmetry rod, uh, 15 pound mono, Eagle Call Aberdeen hook, and a one ounce lead. So I'm going to cast at this piece of structure and see if I can get some. Got one. If, if I have one, it's super small. Oh, look at that. Baby yellowtail snapper. Look at that fish. Pretty. Good that I have found some decent bottom fishing out here. But there you go, little yellowtail snapper. But I'm using a, uh, I don't think I mentioned it, but I'm using this little piece to cut squid. But right now I'm drifting pretty fast because of wind. I might drop anchor, but um, I'm gonna send it back. I'm gonna send, go ahead and go back and see if I can uh, get on the structure a little bit better so I can uh, make some more precise casts. a safety cable. Glad that didn't shut the motor off. Okay, it's got an anchor. Okay, still looks good. Big by anchor. Back up. Okay. If the anchor grabs, it is not grabbed. Okay, the anchor's grabbed. Okay, now we're gonna tie it off. There we go. And we're gonna be Gucci. So then I can, don't have to worry about um, having to make precise uh, drifts. All I have to do is just cast, cause I'm gonna be lined up perfectly with this anchor. So, now I'm all set up to see if I can catch them. Got one. I got here. Is it another yellow tail? Of course it is. There we go. Maybe getting a little bit bigger. Nowhere near the size I need though. I can't get over. Oh, okay, there you go. I can't get over how uh how pretty these fish are. Sorry, I, this guy's deciding to be difficult. 
Here we go. Little yellow tail. Another one. Oh boy, oh, we're going the wrong way. We're getting smaller now. I'm glad I put on these small hooks though, but there we go, another baby yellow tail. I apologize for this wind too. It's uh, pretty nasty out here. I'm just glad my anchor's holding. There we go. That's a little bit better fish, guys. Oh yeah. This guy's actually fighting instantly after I hook my other fish. What do we have here? Ooh, a grunt. It's a nice grunt, actually. So now I know a good spot to catch fish for dinner, I guess. Big grunt. Of course, he's pooping, but... There we go. Species number two of the day is my forest fish. White grunt. Taking pictures just to show everyone since... Uh, there we go. Grunt. See ya, buddy. Okay. Another one. Okay, that's yellowtail number five. Five yellowtail. Pretty good. Another one. There's one. This is a good fish, guys. Good. Probably another grunt. Yep. He probably choked it too. Yeah, I let him eat it too long. Luckily, I have pliers somewhere. Yep. So another white grunt. That's what they're called. Ow. They're prickly. You've probably seen these fish being caught in my Florida video. Must be a whole school of them down there. So yellowtail and grunts. I wouldn't be surprised if there was like a maybe a paired fish or something. But watch this. So just cast right back out to that little thing. Let it sink. I'm casting like three to five feet off of it. And like as soon as you dot down, ready? Tap, 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 tap. And these are probably just little fish biting, but still, it's a good thing for kids rather than trolling just. See, I got one now. But just, I just anchored out up. See this? Up, oh, he just came off. There's another little yellow tail, but just anchoring out. And nice. Anchoring out in this uh, bottom fishing. I also enjoy bottom fishing too. I haven't bottom fished this whole trip. So it's a nice treat. Videos, I think the, but it's a white grunt. Okay, we're going smaller now. Yellow tail just fell off in here. Yellow tail number 11. Okay guys, I'm hooked up with my last fish and it feels like a grunt. Pretty good grunt now, I'm feeling it. Yep, so this is gonna be my last fish of the day. Um, I gotta go in for dinner, we're eating dinner out, so uh, I gotta get cleaned up. But I ended this day with either 12 or 13 or 14 grunts, no, 12 or whatever. I ended the day with a bunch of snappers and three grunts, so not a bad day. Definitely gonna be out tomorrow, so I think I'm just gonna end the video here. So as always guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Now I gotta pull up this darn anchor.